In this tutorial, we will cover how to add a card holder to the DNA Fusion system. We will start by selecting the Personnel Browser from the standard toolbar. The Personnel Browser houses all the card holders that have been entered into the system. There are many ways to add a card holder, but for this example, we will right click on the All Card Holder header. From the context menu, we will select the Add New Card Holder item. Once the card holder record opens, we will notice that there are three main personnel tabs Employee Info, Employee Info Page 2, and the Card tab. We will enter the card holder's information into the desired fields. The Location, Department, Site, and Title fields are pre configured drop downs that allow you to select the desired entry. Let's check out the Employee Info Page 2. This page includes fields such as employee ID and employee number, as well as any predefined custom fields. The New Card tab is where the card number is entered along with the signing of access levels. We will enter the card number in the Credential field. In order to save the record, we will right-click in the record and select the Update option. Since I have personnel groups configured, DNA prompts me to add the cardholder to a personnel group. Personnel groups can be set up with a default access level, and once the cardholder is placed in the group, they receive the correct access. For this tutorial, however, we will select the No option. The next step is to assign an access level to the card. To add access levels, right-click in the Access Levels section of the card. From the menu, we will select the Add, Remove, Modify Access option. The Assign Access Levels dialog will appear. From here, we will select the access levels that the cardholder needs assigned, and we'll click the OK button to add the access levels to the card. I have added a custom Update Cardholder button to my toolbar for convenience. This produces the same effect as right-clicking in the cardholder's record and selecting the Update option. I will go ahead and close the cardholder's record. There are numerous ways in which cardholders can be added to the system. The trick is finding the easiest method for you. We look forward to seeing you again for another tutorial.